In this video, we're gonna install the development environment in Mac. I have a fresh install of Mac OS X in this video. So you need to install JIT and Node.js in order to develop our workflow. So this is the website JIT-SCM.com. And here you can see we have this button that says download for Mac. You can click here and this will take you to the download page. But I have to say that this never works. <laughs> so you can click here on the click here to download manually. And this will take you to the SourceForge website. And this will install the JIT OS X installer. So let's wait until this finish downloading. And you can see here on the top is downloading. The other program or application that we need is Node.js. You can download the from these two different versions, the latest version, the latest stable version, and the new version. We're gonna download this one. So you can download here, click here. And this will download Node.js and npm into our computer. So let's wait until this finish downloading. And we are going to install the, the programs in our computer. So now you can see that they are downloaded. Open the finder. And here on downloads, you will find the two packages. So we're going to install JIT first. So double click here. Then I'm going to open the package. And you can see that we have this warn. I can click here on OK and open the system preference here on the security and privacy. You can open anyway. So you can click here on continue, install, and then uh, this will prompt asking for the password. You can click here on install software. And you can see that the installation was successful. So you can click here on close and open the, the terminal. And you can add something like JIT version. And this will print the version that we have installed. So let's close this. And let's install Node.js. So I'm going to open Node.js. And I can click here on continue, continue again, agree. Then click on install. Again, this is prompt, uh, prompting, asking for the password. Click here, uh, add the password and click here on install software. And now you can see that uh, the installation has finished. You can click here on close. Again, open the terminal and let's type node dash b now you can see the version is 6.9.2 and also you can add npm b and this is when you install node.js it also install npm which is the node package manager and now you can see that we have the both versions so the final step here we need to install i'm going to add npm install I'm going to make this bigger. You can click here on view and bigger, bigger. And you can add something like this. NPM install. And then I'm going to add the dash G. And here I'm going to install Gulp. This way you can install Gulp globally in your computer. And if you get an error, you can add sudo at the beginning, sudo npm install, and then you type your password. And this will ensure that everything is installed properly because we have a problem with the permissions. And you can see that we have some worms. You don't have to worry for the worms. 
everything is, is, is fine. So now we have installed Gulp, we have JIT, we have an NPM, and we have we have installed Node.js. So now the development the development environment is ready. So let's continue working in the next video.